it feels like we're driving ourselves crazy by how we are exaggerating things, cherry picking things, distorting things. And certainly among activists, there is just no disposition to get the facts straight. I mean, this is, this is another asymmetry that I've noticed when you're talking about what it's like to interact with the far left and the far right. It is far more frustrating and deranging for me to try to deal with what's coming at me from the far left than from the far right. I mean, this has been a routine experience I've had now for a decade and a half touching controversial issues. I mean, when I'm dealing with someone from the far right, they may despise me. I mean, they, they may think that I should be killed for my thought crimes but they're far less likely to actually distort my positions on any topic. I mean, they actually take my positions as they are. You know, they may hate me because I'm Jewish. They may hate me because I'm an atheist. They may think I'm going to hell. But what I'm not going to get is just an endless series of cynical, gaslighting, bad faith takes on what I just said. On the left, that's virtually all I get. And that asymmetry bothers me because I'm attempting to you know, kind of widen the purview of the reality-based community here and talk about facts honestly, and then we can prosecute our disagreements on that basis. But I mean, what we're noticing coming from the left now is a, an appetite for destroying the reputations of people for reasons that are, this goes under the, the meme of you, you, know, you have to break eggs to, to make an omelet. There, there are people who are being scapegoated for sexism or racism or transphobia or whatever, you know, pick your sin, who they know are not guilty of these things, but it's just the, you know, this, the sacrificial object that needs to be hurled from the ramparts to, perhaps they would follow your logic, to drag everything leftward. You know, you have to be that extreme. But it's, it is stifling honest conversation in science and elsewhere in media to a degree that I, you know, I'm, I'm totally unfamiliar with. I mean, maybe this was true a few decades ago when political correctness first became a, a meme, and I was just too young to appreciate it. But it does really feel like a new moment of moral panic on the left, which is capturing so much of the mainstream.